I wanted to talk about mindset and attitude and what is the proper mindset to have to be a good dressage rider and a good trainer. So I've been reading a book called Mindset and basically either you have a growth mindset or you have a fixed mindset. So in a fixed mindset, that means that you believe that either you were born a good rider or you were born a bad rider. That some riders are just innately more talented than others. And that no matter how hard you work at it, you're never gonna be a better rider. Versus a growth mindset is where you believe that you can become a better rider. If you put in the hours, if you put in the time, if you work on your position, if you go to the gym, if you ride as much as you can, you can become a better rider. So it's really important that you get in the growth mindset where you believe, you know what, I can become a better rider, I can learn how to ride, it, but it requires work and determination and persistence and every day getting on your horse, you know, practicing your position, um, riding as many different horses as you can, all of that. So this concept also applies to your horse. Um, a lot of people I see are stuck in a fixed mindset. They say, well, you know, my horse isn't this and my horse isn't that and my horse has this problem instead of, you know, you wanna have a growth mindset where you're thinking, all right, I can make my horse better. My horse is spooky, but I'm gonna work on it. I'm gonna make it so much better. Or my horse doesn't have the best trot, but you can make that better. You have to train it, you have to work on it, you have to teach him to pee off and massage. Um, you know, my brother, he said to me, you know, dressage means training, it doesn't mean buying. So it's not about buying a better horse, it's about taking the horse you have working with its problems and getting it better. It can get better. All of the top horses in the world have problems. And, you know, especially as young horses, you know, a good Grand Prix horse is not a perfect young horse. So, you know, take what you have and work with it and make it as good as it can be and see every challenge that you come across in your training as an opportunity for you to learn and also to make your horse better because that's really what it's all about. So I hope this helps. You know, it's the attitude you have towards your horses, towards your riding, towards your training is really the difference of whether or not you're gonna make it in this sport.